Hey guys, it's your boy Young Ty bringing you another video, and uh, yeah, right now, you know, repping PlayStation gang. Oh god. <laughs> Sorry, rep, repping PlayStation gang is the only way. Don't don't make fun of the fit. I'm in pajamas, but um, we got a double Gee. unboxing. So um, in here we got some. Whoa, you almost saw my address. In here we got some Angelus goodies. If you don't know who Angelus is, they're basically shoe customizer people. You know, you get your paint brushes, laces, aglets, sole dyes, all that good stuff. Need some shoe stuff? Go to Angelus. And then what I've been waiting for? A little custom chain action. Okay, wait, wait, wait. He legitimately waited about like a whole week yeah, when it was. You're not in the camera. Like he legitimately waited like two weeks for this chain, and every time the the postal service came, they they didn't have it. So Basically, it's supposed waiting. to take 21 days to get here, and it took 29, 30. It's great, guys. It's fantastic. But um, yeah. I'm just gonna open. I'm not gonna go into good detail about the this stuff because I'll be doing a video where I'm restoring my 2002 Columbia okay. 11s. Uh huh. Can we it doesn't matter. They got some good, good. Packaging. And if you don't know what those are, it's a plate. Gotta, gotta bring it back. This is the shoe, guys. OG. As you can see, we got that oxidation going no, on. Let's keep them crease free. Got the tree in there. Got the lace. So yeah, this guy need to change the laces. So here we have some Jordan 11 Low laces by Lace Lab. He's <laughs> I was reading the comments. They said they look like 11 laces. They look exactly like 11 laces. That's good. That's cool. 45 inches for the low, 54 for the height. Just if you need to know. And here we have the soul bright. This is gonna make it all happen, guys. As you can see, as example on there, from that to that. Let me see. Oh, my nail got some some barbecue in it, you know? We've been eating brats, hot dogs, and now we got some... Ribs. Yeah. So that's off the way. Hold up, let me... Receipt. You know what I'm saying? Don't want to show y'all that because it has my address on it, apparently. Didn't know that one time. And uh, here we go. Now, I probably am going to try to talk to the people at Shop Go Supply about their packaging because, I mean, like... You don't feel special with the black square. But let's go ahead and pop it open together, folks. Whoop. Bubble wrap. <laughs> Ooh. Oh! Ooh, that, that that goes hard. That yo. This is the pendant, guys. I got tie, you know, because we got Oh, the tennis chain looking yeah. crispy. Tennis chain is iced out. Tennis chain. Yeah, like a life so, house. Let's take this out the packages, and I'm going to get back to you. All right. Didn't unpackage it, but, you know, I'm going to still do it right now anyway, because I completely got off guard. It's supposed to be five millimeters, but, I mean, it looks, it honestly looks a little small. But that's all good. Jeez, man. The quality of this chain is, like, really good. Like, it looks very nice. Hold up. Let me untangle it. Let me show these folk. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm getting oofed at the moment. Trying to show y'all. Wow, the lighting. So, we got two tennises. I'm just gonna go and show y'all the other one. I'll get a better show of that, but this is the chain, 18 inches, because that's what I like my chains to be. Oh yeah, let me see that. This is supposed to be five, this is a five millimeter chain from Gemstone Gods, and this is what they say is five millimeters. So I guess when I'm looking at it in the camera, it does look about the same. This just uses the square style setting, and this uses a more round princess style. So, that's why. And then we got this boy right here. Best believe I'm going to be pairing my necklaces, as I have already been doing. Really like the paired look. Wow, pendant, pendant feels good too. Like it, like it. Got tie right there. Your cross pendant is it here. My cross pendant is here. I just didn't take it out. That's the backing, guys. You know, um, hollowed with holes for most refraction of light. Y'all can even see it through the backing that it's starting to do some little rainbow action. So, um, yeah. Now, I'm going to put these two things together and get back to y'all with it on my neck. Right, so, the chain is on now. It is very difficult to... Like, the way they have it set up, the chain strength of staying, like, straight or flipped, it's like it's constantly in motion. 
type deal. So y'all can't see the stones right now. But best believe I'll show you them just because. But um, yeah, that's what it looks like. You know, Yogan Tai Boy really mess with this pendant and it feels good. So um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead, pop over into the different lighting and get y'all the flash test on this bad boy. Here we go. Whoa, this is no editing at all. No changing the like brightness level or exposure. This is straight up them. Sheesh, I can tell from when we opened up the package that it, the clarity was great. In person, it looks a whole lot better. You can clearly see each thing going on, but even on the camera, I know you have to see like this dancing array of colors. Let's get the pendant involved. Wow. So yeah, this is the shine test, y'all. We are really very good shine on these stones. Like, look at that. That's very good quality. And I think to fix this, I'll just have to do a counterclockwise rotation so that it stops spinning every time I try to put it on. Because I don't want them to see this. You want to be seeing these beautiful things. So yeah, I'm going to kick back to me wearing them and I'll pair it with the other pieces that I've had so far. So I'm back. All the ice. This is what it looks like paired, you know. Two-tone drip. Only way to go. But, um, yeah. Love the chain, guys. Love it. So, um, thank y'all for watching. This honestly feels, this my, my neck finally got some weight to it. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah. Thank y'all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, actually, I'm not gonna end it yet. I'll show y'all how to close the clasp just in case you get it. Because that seems to be a recurring problem with people if they get a product. They don't know how to clasp it. So, one more look. And, um, yeah. Now I'm going to show y'all how to clasp the tennis chain. So, let's get that. She still have it on. I will be using this as an example for it's bigger and allows you to see it better because it is the same exact style of clasping system. You will have this end right here with a piece sticking up just like this. Like It's exactly the same, guys. And you would take this piece, slide it until you hear the click. You would then proceed to taking the two arms and placing them over the little ball. Yeah. Yes. The little ball. And that will close it. I'll be right back. So that's going to conclude the video on my unboxing of my custom tie pendant. Hope y'all enjoyed it. I definitely will be enjoying this pendant. Quality is good so far. We're going to see how it lasts. Um, as far as this gemstone god tension goes, it's still doing okay. But definitely not as good quality as Shop G.O.D. And honestly, might end up buying the tennis chain from them because problems already. So it's kind of what I expected though because I don't really know much about them. But they are gaining fame. But um, I'll still rock it for now. But um, yeah, thank you all for watching. I'm going to keep on making these videos. And uh, another chain review on the way. Heartbreak chain with the tennis so, another chain review for y'all. And an update on the Cuban coming up soon because y'all requested that down below. But, let me get out of here. It's your boy, Young Ty, out.